G'day guys, you know it's very easy to get caught up in the addictive whirlwind of strength training, lifting progressively heavier and cycling those loadings to continue to push your limits, especially when you start to see those goals. Remember though, looking for those progressively heavier weights isn't always the answer. Naturally it can be the perfect solution if we're after pure or absolute strength, but if we're after power or speed, then hitting those lighter percentages can yield greater results. Enter the Enduro Rope, the newer and lighter addition to the Power Rope family, aiming to give more variety and added benefit to this epic conditioning system. Measuring 15 metres long, the Enduro Rope has the evil black appearance of something far more sinister than an iron edge power rope. With red end caps to protect against fraying, the Enduro Rope is 1.5 inches thick and weighs in at a mighty 9.5 kilos. 5.5 kilos lighter than its 1.5 inch cousin. Also, as you can see in the comparison, the Enduro rope is substantially more flexible than the sizal version as well. This is due to the fact that the Enduro is made from polyethylene, making the rope not only lighter and ultra flexible, but more durable, water resistant, and totally incapable of shedding, which is a tremendous plus for those who are completely fed up with cleaning up those sizal fibers. But what does all this mean? And how does this newer rope differ from the older ones? Or better still, why would you purchase the Enduro over your nylon casing or regular power rope? Well, for one, the feel of the rope is completely different. As soon as you pick it up, you notice how light the rope feels and how kind it is to the hands, especially if you're used to the standard power rope. Sizal, however, is in fact great for the grip, but isn't really known for its comfort. But really, it's not until you get the rope moving that you start to feel the Enduro's true advantage. The lighter weight means you can move the rope super fast, increasing that overall intensity by allowing to work at a far greater velocity. Adding to this is the Enduro's flexibility. You can literally whip the rope harder and tighter, creating a much sharper undulation to the wave. And not to start sounding like a mad physicist, but this in turn allows you to achieve a greater frequency by shortening the length of each wave. Once again, allowing you to jack up the overall tempo. This of course has a twofold effect. Seasoned power rope users can up their working capacity by generating speeds far greater than they can with their sizal counterparts. And second, this kind of rope is a lot easier for beginners to pick up, allowing them to work on form and technique whilst having a comfortable rope to work with. Remember though, as with all power ropes, the end caps are only there for protecting the rope. So only grab the rope in front of the end cap. Perfect in those commercial environments because there'll be no cleaning up of those shedded fibres and literally anyone can use it. Great in those outdoor applications because of its ultra durability and water resistance and excellent for those power rope pros because now you can work at supersonic speeds. Working heavy and heavier ropes definitely have their place but now you have even greater variety for training stimulus. Jump over to ironedge.com.au if you're after any further information.